So here's how you take your basic measurements. We're gonna do bust, waist, hips, neck, shoulder width. Then I'll show you arm length and then how to get skirt length. So for the bust, we're gonna measure around the fullest part of the bust. I want to do my measurements in inches, but this measuring tape has inches and centimeters. So if you wanted to do it in centimeters, you would just flip the tape over. So for this bust is 34 inches. The waist is the smallest part. I would measure the bust over a good bra, but for the waist, I like to measure against bare skin. So this waist is about 27 and a half inches. And for the hips, you can measure maybe over tights, but I still like to do it against um, just your undergarments. So I would look at the fullest part of your bottom and then measure through the center of that. So for it here, that point is 36 inches. Now for your shoulder width, you're gonna measure from one end of the shoulder to the other. Um, you can find that point by like by holding your arm up and where there's like a divot, that's where you start your shoulder measurement. But on the mannequin, it's easy to see. So from here to here, it's like 15 inches. The neck width, Fifteen inches. The arm length would be from that same point you measure your shoulder width, so from the top of your arm to wherever you want your sleeve to hit you. So, if you were doing like a half sleeve, that would be a little bit past the elbow. For me, I would want that to be like about sixteen inches, three quarter sleeve. For my arm, I would do it at twenty one inches, and then a full length sleeve. For me, it's about 26 and a half inches, but I'm tall, I have long arms, so each person's measurements will be different. Uh, other measurements you may need would be for your back length. You measure from like that bone that's like at the top, at the base of your neck, which will be about here, down to where your waist measurement is. So here it's about 13 and a half, 14 inches. For your skirt, you want to measure if, like for this skirt, the top of the waistband to where you want the hem to be. So I like high waist skirts, so I would measure from here, which will be my waist. Top of my waistband, and I just let the measuring tape fall to the ground and I would look in a mirror and then see wherever I want it to stop, my skirt to stop, is where, um, how many inches it is. So this skirt, it stops at about 30, 31 inches. So then I would know for my skirt, if I want it to be that length, it would be whatever the waistband is and then add the skirt to make the difference. So that's the basic measurements that you can take. For yourself whether you're sewing a garment for yourself or whether you're wanting someone to make it for you but it's good to know how to measure yourself um, and not let other people measure you just because I think it's good to know your body our body changes weekly sometimes as women so it's good to uh, be familiar with your shape and know how you want clothes to fit you